ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Ford Motor Company Chief Operating Officer Mark Fields. Well, good morning, everybody, and thanks for joining us. Uh, clearly, we have some very exciting Mustang news for you today, and we'll get to that in just a moment. But first, let's talk about another vehicle making its, its global debut here in New York, our new Focus sedan. Now, Focus sedan is joining other members of the Focus family that we recently revealed at the Geneva Auto Show. As I just mentioned a few minutes ago in my opening keynote, the original Mustang was introduced to an audience of thousands at the 1964 World's Fair in Flushing Meadows, and to millions through television and international press events. Today, we all know Mustang so well, it may be hard to imagine what a very new idea this car represented at that time. It was a true white space vehicle, a great-looking two-door hardtop or convertible with the flair of a European sports car, and possibly the longest list of options ever offered on any car, and a package easily worth $3,000, all for a surprisingly low starting price of just $2,300 and change. People knew, but this time with a significantly larger car, the all-new Mustang convertible. And under the pressure <clears throat> of a six-hour time crunch, and as you can see, we pulled it off and lifted our 50-year celebration to historic heights. And Bill Ford was there to unveil the perfectly reassembled Mustang convertible. And this is just the first of many iconic landmarks that Mustang will be visiting as it makes its way around the world. In fact, Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Bill Ford. I've been waiting for this day for a long time. Uh, so excited you're all here and here to share uh, the Mustang 50 year limited edition with us. My very first car was a Mustang, a 1975 painted in an electric green show color. And like so many others who've owned Mustangs, I fell in love then and I never looked back. And Mustang is my all time favorite car. It's the look, the unbelievable sound, the fun and the freedom of the open road, and the fact that you don't have to spend a fortune to enjoy all that. You simply cannot have more fun in a car than you can have in a Mustang. The back end also wears a signature badge. The original Mustang wore a lot of chrome, and we're interpreting that in a modern way with enhancements that no other Mustang will have. Most notably, the chrome detailing around the tail lamps which is inspired by the 1962 original design proposal. The unique louvered quarter glass is another vintage touch, harkening back to the 65 Fastback. And the interior also pays homage to the Mustang heritage, which will appear on a numbered ID badge unique to each car. The Mustang 50 year limited edition goes on sale this fall but you don't have to wait that long for a closer look. Please come forward and join us, and we'll be happy to answer your questions. That's pretty rude. That's really rude, you know that, right? Oh. You know that, right? 